Hello everyone. In this video, we are going to take a look at how to find zeros of a function from a given graph. Now, the question is, the graphs of y equals to p of x are given below for some polynomial functions px. So, we have got some polynomial functions and the graphs are given for that. Find the number of zeros of px in each case. So, we need to find out how many zeros each of these polynomials have. So before we actually start working on the problem, let's see how to find the zeros. Let's say this is my graph and this is my x-axis and y-axis. Now where the graph intersects or touches the x-axis, those points will be the zeros of the given function. For example, say the graph is something like this, goes down, up. And then again moves down something like this okay now just see uh, where the graph is intersecting the x-axis so this is my x-axis right so it's intersecting here 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 and here okay so these are the four zeros of the given function now suppose the graph moves like this touches the x-axis and bounces back then this point here is again a zero of the given function so it should either cross the x-axis or it should touch the x-axis okay now let's start with the actual problem the first one see this graph given here is a straight line which is parallel to x-axis and it is not touching the x-axis anywhere or crossing it so there are no zeros second one it's intersecting here just one point so therefore one zero next one one point two three three points of intersection so that means three zeros coming to the fourth one now this graph is crossing x-axis at this point and this point so that means two points of intersection two zeros fifth one one two three and four so four zeros and the last one, it's crossing here, it's touching the x-axis here, and again touching the x-axis here. That means there are three zeros for the last one. So it's as simple as that. All you have to do is see where the graph is crossing the x-axis or touching the x-axis, and those will be the zeros. Thank you.